The Guam Bahama Port Authority launching a new initiative that is expected to revitalize the economy of Freeport. But organizing members of the Reef Project say community involvement is needed. Here's Ramiko Knowles. Principal and Executive Director of the Grand Bahama Port Authority, Rupert Hayward, says in a time of economic uncertainty, every community needs a plan. He adds that this is one of the reasons the Reef Project was created. He says results are needed to bring relief to the Bahamian people and produce job opportunities. We have many, we do have many obstacles in Grand Bahama right now, whether it's regulation, whether it's big storms. And we are not going to solve those problems unless we work as a collective body, as, unless we work with all the stakeholders and all the members of our community to make sure that this vision represents uh, all of our interests. And that's really what REEF is about. It's about creating a short-term action plan, a long-term vision that brings in foreign direct investment so that we can create 10 jobs for every Bahamian, not just 10 Bahamians right now looking for one job. Director of Operation for the Grand Bahama Port Authority, Filcher Grant, says they've heard the cries of Grand Bahamians and the Reef Project is so much more than a consultation paper or website. She invites everyone to get involved as the end result will be a better free port. And we're inviting people to not speak your words into the wind. We spend so much valuable time putting our words in places where they're long forgotten, in chat groups and in videos, Facebook. We're asking you to put your money where your memes are. Log on to our website, www.reef.gbpa.com. Read the consultation paper. Take the survey and put your feedback where it will count to make a better free report for us and future generations. Consultant and committee lead Robert Adams says the Reef Project is not only important to Freeport's economy, but to the national economy as well. He says a revitalized Freeport will translate into a revitalized Bahamas. I've said before that the road to a better economic reality for the Bahamas lies through Freeport. Um, and it is my belief that um, as soon as we can take hold and embrace that vision um, and implement real change in Freeport uh, in collaboration with central government, uh, we, will, we, will, we will manifest. Ramiko Knowles, ZNS Network News.